What causes a virus to turn humans into a primitive-like form in War of the Planet of the Apes? And before I answer that question, there are spoilers ahead. So with that said, here we go. The disease was being set up in war the same way that it was being set up in Rise. We somewhat see the full effects of it on some significant characters to the story. In war, the colonel gives some exposition about the mutating virus and why he decided to take his own son's life. His son somehow became much less intelligent and mute, mimicking the behavior of an actual ape, and further hinting at the future of the human race in possible upcoming Planet of the Apes films. Since the colonel's seen the virus up close and personal, he thinks that there should be no risks of sparing the lives of anyone showing signs of the mutated virus, which would give some clarity as to why he has his soldiers chanting every single day as he overlooks them. Not entirely to boost his own ego, but mainly to see if anyone is infected as they wouldn't be able to talk, let alone chant. The colonel also goes into explaining that every human carries the virus inside them, and it mutates when coming in contact with someone who is sick. In order to better understand why the virus turns people mute by affecting their vocal cords and making them have a less intelligible thought process, we would have to go back to the first Rise of the Planet of the Apes film. In Rise, Will Rodman invented the drug that would help the brain repair itself, using it on his own father to cure the disease of Alzheimer's. At first, the dad is cured, but about five years later, the virus changes, and Will claims on his audio recording that it will come back with a vengeance. And it does. This this progressed terribly for the dad as he was very disoriented and out of touch with the world, although he didn't necessarily lose his ability to speak. But they came out with a different version of the drug that eventually led to infecting the people such as Will's co-workers. So the reason the virus would turn someone mute directly goes into the core of what it was trying to prevent. The virus was caused from a search for a cure for Alzheimer's. And from Alzheimer's, people can lose their ability to speak and vocalize their thoughts while also losing control of other bodily functions, let alone become very disoriented and having trouble processing memories, making them forgetful. Not saying the virus is directly Alzheimer's, but it's definitely taking on some sort of a form that branches off of the disease. And it could be a minor case where you lose the ability to speak, as well as it can tamper with some parts of the mind. Because we can see from Nova's character that she is infected, but she is not completely dysfunctional from it, just behaving more like an animal that is self-aware. And it's hard to tell at this point how it affects the memories and overall cognitive awareness of the characters, since Nova just started following the apes with no problem even though they shot and killed what appeared to be her father when they first encountered her. She looked to be completely content with it, but when the colonel was infected, he was self-aware enough to want to take his own life. And if they plan on making a new trilogy, we will most likely see the humans all infected. In the original Planet of the Apes, humans are treated like cattle as they were less intelligent and mute. This group doesn't necessarily give off the vibe to treat humans in such a way because throughout the film they ended up being more human than the actual humans, especially for the way they've been taking care of Nova. But depending on how many years are in between war and the fourth film, the circumstances and outlook on the humans could change drastically. And in the next film, we will most likely be shown a new human resembling George Taylor's character from the original Planet of the Apes come down from space. Not in infected with any virus and come across the now infected human race of primitive beings. And hopefully that adds some clarity. If you guys like this video, go ahead and hit subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video discussing War of the Planet of the Apes.